How is it going everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about why your biceps are different sizes. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I do appreciate um, the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, dylanberg999. So why are your biceps different sizes? This is very common, believe it or not. It's actually, it's actually one of the most common things. And I would say almost just about everyone that works out probably has this problem. So generally the size difference in your arms is generally half an inch. If it's bigger than half an inch, like an inch, an inch and a half, then what I would do is I would stop training the arm that's big and then only work on the arm that's small. That's 100% what I would do. That's just training your muscle imbalances. And that means training with dumbbell exercises, not doing barbell. Doing barbell exercises will continue to work both, both arms or both biceps, and they're still gonna grow at the exact same rate. So make sure you do dumbbells. Generally, most people are right hand dominant. So generally that means your left arm is gonna be smaller. The way it is right now, my right arm is 17 and a half inches. My left arm is 17, maybe 17 and a quarter. So there's about a quarter to half an inch difference. Um, you can't tell though in pictures, they look basically exactly the same. It's kind of weird though, because they are built a little bit differently. What I've noticed is this head has a longer head to it, and this head has a shorter head to it. They're both it, it, they're both pretty similar, but I've noticed this one has a more of a peak to it, but this one's much, much thicker. So um, your biceps are going to be different sizes. They don't have to be if you're concerned about that, that quarter or half an inch difference, then literally just stop training this arm and just start training this one. Eventually it will catch up. The thing is though, to add half an inch to your bicep, it's not gonna be done in a couple of weeks. To add that, I would say would take three to four months, probably at least. Just training this arm, not doing this arm. I would give it at least three to four months. It may take six months at the very longest, I would say a year. But again, you're literally adding half an inch. So adding half an inch, adding an inch <clears throat> to your biceps, that takes a while. That's not just gonna be done overnight. So just keep that in mind, it will take a little bit, but most people aren't too concerned about it because generally it's not too noticeable. But like I said, if, if you have bigger than half an inch difference, maybe you wanna work on that. So that's what I would do, you dumbbell exercises. So end of video, uh, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, please follow me on Instagram, Dylanberg999, thank you.